Day two without cable at the house. We have electricity, so it's not a total loss. But it's really, really bad. <laughs> I think it's driving my wife insane. She's, she's just laughing for no reason in the background. <laughs> okay, not, not crazy at all. So I guess on the bright side, we always have something to watch on TV. We just watch the security cam and see what the donkeys are doing, which is pretty much nothing, like usual. Or we can look at the router and the lack of lights that are useful. Yeah, I think I'm going to call it in when I go to work today because I get the distinct impression that they've actually forgotten about us or they uh, haven't noticed that we're off the grid. Because sometimes when you have trees down in certain areas, they don't get any feedback despite the fact that the system from um, Spectrum is two-way. They don't get feedback because uh, well, right now, that's the accurate time. That's the time of the cable box. So the cable box thinks it's somewhere else. As one might expect. This is affecting Terrible Ted horribly. I'm not quite sure how he's going to survive this event. Not having cables tough on a Yorkie. Alright, well, maybe it's not all that tough. All right, dude, I guess karma caught back up with me. You have a, you have a good rest of your lunch. Yeah, he's got to go back to work. I just shut down the generator. I had that running for a couple of minutes because, naturally, when I go home for lunch, well, you guessed it, the power was out. And it's a perfectly sunny day out. I mean, I got the, I got the top off the car. Uh, it's windy, though, so I can definitely see why it's out. Time to shut down the garage. You never know.